One man, one bag. What did you buy, Brad? Secret. Actually, a secret? Oh. Oh, okay. <laughs> They're already moving in. Blacky and Blastoy. <laughs> Every time we turn off the lights, they sneak in. And when we turn them on, I caught you, Blacky. I caught you, huh? You're always staying here. What are you doing, huh? So funny, man. Uh, obviously, the lighting isn't done, and we haven't even turned on the lights, but I uh, hope you got a little quick perspective there. It's pretty cool. The bamboo blinds are down on the main super pileg, so it looks really dark right now, but if it's open, um, it's going to be really funky. What's your prediction? I think Blackie and Velocity will go back to you. Huh? I think they'll, they'll follow you wherever you go. It's kind of cool to see this from this perspective, man. <laughs> Blaan! Onside my anger biggie! Blaan! Brad, few kipu. Yeah? Few kipu. Alright, few kipu. That guy's rocking mobile legends. The legend of the mobile. I think that's a very popular game in the Philippines. I've never actually played it, but. Anyways, Trendy's cooking. Uh, I want to figure out what he's going to cook. I don't know what it is, but again. Allah, huh? the only ingredient that you. Allah, your chinelas. Allah, ka. Feed, feed this to the chicken. How do we do? We love the chickens <laughs> so much now. They're our friends. They're our friends. We love so the chickens. Come, You're going to use this to solidify this together into patties. No. <laughs> You're wrong again. Really? <laughs> I'm trying to figure out what he's going to cook. He won't tell me. Outside. <laughs> I gotta stop saying that. I keep, uh, I keep making jokes that Jundi is an Aswang because he's to us, uh, what's it called? Oh! I wanted to see what you're cooking, Mum Rose. Mm. This is. Fortinula frito na isda. We put a lot of vegetables. Nice. And uh, we have. Uh, Okay, I have a question for Mum Rose because I'm genuinely intrigued. Um, I've been joking around a lot lately, mm -hmm. calling Jundi an Aswang, right? <laughs> but like, just total joke. But here, like in Katahil, or in Mandaya, is there like a mythical creature? Or is it... But like, are there other... Like, is there a specific... Aswang, Capri, Duende, uh, the uh, white lady. <laughs> of course, of course. Of course, Santilmo, oh. and a lot more. It's just the same all over the Philippines. You know, there's uh, creatures, they just come in different names. I also, like, I also, I want to interrupt because I want to know, do you believe any of them? Or what's your take on it? Not really, but you know, and I, you know what, uh, there was, uh, you know, like, uh, an interpretation that uh, the Filipinos derived from the Spaniards. Mm. And the priors, the priests before, they con they need to control the people. They don't want them oh. to go out in the open and meet each other in the evening because they're ap afraid of rebellion. So what they do, they invented this, you don't go out, there's Capri, there's Aswang, you know that. When I was small, my mom used to scare us. We don't, if we don't eat our food in the evening, they would, he, she would say, you know, if you don't eat your food, 
your uh, they call it umagad maybe it's like a soul or what's whatever it is they said she said it will get up in the evening because you're hang she, it, it is hungry and they will go open the pots mm -hmm. and then when when the when the cover is closed and your oh my god your soul maybe it's inside you will die what <laughs> Yeah, and so we need to eat because we're scared. The our umagad, our uh, whatever it is, they call it umagad. Uh, something like from the inside will will wake up, get up in the evening, and go uh, the stubborn <laughs> to the pot. My my take angry. my take is this, Mama Rose. <laughs> Even if I don't believe it, I will always respect it. Correct. Yeah, that's the way I look at it. So. Each to their own. I don't. You don't have the tikbala and then the kapri. No, we don't have. The you know, like you know what the difference. Uh, I don't think we have tikbala here. I what we have is kapri. Kapri. Uh, yeah, kapri is a huge guy mm. with long hair and uh, you know hairy body and the, smoke a big big pipe and lives on the top of the tree. <laughs> well, that's that's. <laughs> That's exactly yes. Ayuk. 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 Can I, can I tell you what I called you? No. You Don't stop because I'm busy. <laughs> that didn't work. <laughs> Any guesses? No. That's, I'm, that's the Mandaya from Mananangal. Yeah. Okay. I'm calling you Mananangal. Yeah. Okay. 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 Yeah. This is so funny, I should have remembered this. On Vancouver Island where I grew up, and in fact the place where I studied in Victoria, BC, and I've been to this place many times, Thetis Lake, says here, I typed into Google, mythical Canadian monsters, and there's a top eight list. The Thetis Lake monster right there. It says, this creature is known as Canadian Lizard Man. It looks like a slea stack, a slea stack mixed with Gill Man. The creature from the Black Lagoon kind of thing. Supposedly he's located in Thetis Lake. I remember this, I've been swimming so many times in Thetis Lake area, jogging around the trails there. And people would always like mention something like this. Um, yeah, so I, I think this is classic. Wherever you are in the world, there's always some sort of monster or monsters. What's a pinaka favorite, Nico? Pinaka favorite of... Bawi Bakya. What's that? Bawi Bakya. What's it? So there's a pig that's wearing a tic-tac shoe. What? A, a pig with shoes? Mm. Bawi Bakya. Have you ever heard of Bawi Bakya? Baboy, Bawi Bakya. A pig with shoes. Mm. That doesn't even sound scary, bro. Mm? That doesn't sound scary nah. at all. When we were kids, we get scared because it's night time, dark. That's what your parents do so that you will not go out that's, during dark. That's why, that's, why we, that's why we put lots of ahus or bawang in our peanuts. That's why we're eating that, no? My ease is back. Mm. For Instagram, John? Yeah. Nice. Uh, well deserved Instagramming by John D. Okoy, the spas, my ease, the bleep on a special sauce, Instagrammers, and talk about <laughs> what? Instagrammers club. No, my. No, it's desert, Damai. Damai Instagrammers. Damai Instagrammers. Damai Instagrammers. 
Instagramming. Is Okoi can't Okoi be a mythical creature as well? Yeah. Oh. Which, which one? A mermaid. Like a mermaid? Merman. Okoi, Merman. 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 Is the Bisaya of Merman? The Merman. Uh, that's what it is. If the mermaid is beautiful, Okoi is very funny. Ugly. Mm. Mm. If the remember that children and adults, if the mermaid is beautiful, the okoi is very pangit. Oh. I'm learning a lot tonight, man. Okay, this keeps getting crazier. Kiki. Kikik, kikik. Kikik. The boys are telling me about kikik. kikik. Is that the noise they make? Mm. Kikik, 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 kikik. Supposedly it's birds around rice fields. But what's the, what's the thing? Dundee, what's the... What do they do? The elders before, they tend to let us... What you call this? Let us believe that kikik would get the pregnant women. They would eat the... You know, the... What? No, mm. oh, that's the koan. That's the idea of Kiki. But when we get older, we know the truth that it's only a bird. Only a bird. <laughs> that that's it's their mating real. call at night. <laughs> What's that? Mm, that's Speaking of which, there's a noise outside the fence. Okay. Into the motorcycle. Into Kiki. Kiki. No, no. Kiki. 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 Hello. Madman, I completely understand right. if you want to keep the lights on tonight. Because <laughs> I'm afraid? Because you're afraid of the... Uh -huh. You're afraid of nothing, are you? That's just a bad I'm joke. I'm afraid if they surprise me. I'll be afraid. I'm just joking know. around. That was fun talking about this stuff. Good night. Good night, Madman. So don't do it! Ah! I'm just joking. This again. Kick it! Kick it! Kick it! Kick it! Kick it! Kick it! What's the new Tikbalan, brad? <laughs> the modern Tikbalan? Yeah. You see them on the streets at night? Act like this. Uh, ML. <laughs> <laughs> Tikbalan. <laughs> Mobile Legend. <laughs> brad, do you know what? You see them a lot here. What? You see them along the best spot for the signal. Mm. Uh. Looking for the best spot signal. <laughs> <laughs> there's light. No surprise, there's light around Maybe the bushes. Uh, the light will illuminate from the phone. <laughs> the modern, the modern, the modern What's happening? Uh, oh. oh my gosh! They really are taking over, bro. Well, you can see the Blaan boys are setting up scaffolding up front because they're going to start doing finishing here. 
One thing I've really been debating and kind of talking about is you see that big concrete line underneath the, uh, the deck right here? This one? I think we're putting some sort of weaving there or maybe an Amakan pattern or I don't know, let me know what you think. I'm also thinking about putting Nipa uh, just on the outer roof where the deck is. Things I'm going to talk to single engineer about. I'm going to see him in a few days. In the meantime, the Plan boys are on form. Few Flafos! Few Flafos! Ayan. Okay, the San Alfonso boys are back because they're just going to do a little bit of work here on the front. We're just going to prepare it for the full moon that might happen in, uh, what's the date today? Maybe in a week or so. I think I just came out of the ocean swimming. Uh, you'll notice, I give you guys a lot of Blaan words, but actually uh, Blaan isn't local here to Kata'il. It's very Mandaya or Kamayo. Um, all of these guys here, Kabbalah Mandaya, no? Yeah, Kabbalah yeah. Kamayo. Mandaya proud. Mandaya proud, I like that. Ba. How about in Mandaya, like, I don't know, like Walako Kabbalah? Oh, Wakasayud. Wakasayud? Oh, Wakasayud. Wakasayud. Wakasayud Mandaya Karun. Karo, Basin Bohon. Basin Bohon. Wakasayud. You gotta do that, bro. Tiggy Brad, oh yes. The sand is coming back. Yeah, the sand is coming back. Actually, look at this. Um, the sand is returning. So hopefully, we've already seen the worst of the soil erosion. The sand's coming back. Here it is. Woo! I feel like this is getting up more. The sand feels like it's coming back. So, knock on wood. Knock on wood. I, I want you to, Mama Rosa, I want you to do something quickly. Can you just quickly talk to me in straight Mandaya? Just uh, fast, go, yes. say anything you want. Ah, wakoy sayod. Oh, wakoy sayod. Wakoy sabot. Ah, that means I don't understand. You didn't understand. Nice. Uh, something else I didn't understand. Last night the guys were telling me about Baboy Bakya. Have you heard this? Baboy ba Bakya? Supposedly, Bakya. Is, is, I was researching. Is Bakya a type of Filipino shoe? Bakya. 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 Oh. Do, do you know what it is? Baboy nga nag Bakya. Oh. It's a joke. It's a day. Yeah, it's just like a joke. Like, uh, because, uh, you know, the pigs don't wear shoes, right? And then they would say, Baboy nga nagbakya, means somebody. So, uh, sometimes they would say, uh, a, a very fat guy yeah. or a woman. They would call the Baboy nga nagbakya, means uh, a Baboy, a, a pig who is wearing shoes. The guys told me that their parents scared them, saying a Baboy bakya is coming to get you. <laughs> Okay, I mean Granola. Therene's about to win a award for being an amazing woman entrepreneur uh, here in the Philippines uh, through Go Negotio. Go Negotio is a big uh, organization uh, that does a lot of positive stuff for social enterprises or small businesses around the Philippines. That's that. We talked about all sorts of strange creatures last night. Jundi is not an aswang. I'll probably stop calling me. Are you okay? Are we still fr are we still friends? No. What? <laughs> are we still friends? Yes. Okay. Are you actually an aswang? You'll never know. 